church. Um, my testimony is just, I'm thankful. I am thankful. I am thankful. I am thankful. I have, <clears throat> it's been a long week. Um, like I said, with everything going on in the world, but it's also just been a long week work and you know we have a lot of preparing to do we got family coming in and it's just it's been a long week but by the grace of god we are making it through and that's why i say i'm thankful because the lord has been on our side we have saw a lot of things go on we have been through a lot of things but god never lets us down God will never, never let us down. No matter what we go through, God is a good God. Yes. I'm just thankful that he saw fit to save each and every one of us. That he saw fit to actually call me friend. He saw fit to hear my cries and hear my prayers and just hear my praise. Because, you know, if he doesn't hear your praise, how can he answer your prayers? Mm -hmm. You know? It's, it's a lot when you pray to God, pray to God, pray to God, but sometimes you just need to praise to God. Thank Him. You know, appreciate Him. Tell Him you know that He is the one that brought you out of that situation. Tell Him you know that He is the one that blessed me with this new job I'm about to start. He is the one. She may be a handful, but He blessed me with a, a very outspoken two-year-old. And I'm happy about it <laughs> because it could be the opposite. You know, I know a lot of people that got kids that are sick. I know a lot of people that got kids that have, you know, some kind of illness. And God has blessed my daughter so far to be in good health, to be in good spirits. She's very mouthy, but she's talking. You know, I appreciate that. Not all the time, but I appreciate that. <laughs> but that's what I mean by being thankful. Yeah. I, I ask God every day to just touch her as much as he cover her all day long, every minute of the hour, every minute of the day. You know, this is a trying world. I, I, I'm scared for my daughter. I'm scared for kids that I know, my nephews that are strong black men growing up in this world. I'm scared for them. This is this is a fearful time. These these two men sitting on the front line here. I'm scared for them because this is a trying time in this world where unfortunately y'all are a target. Unfortunately, you know, my brothers in the back, y'all are a target. And we just need to pray that God comes down and God touches these people that are targeting you and realize we are not the enemy. We are not each other's enemy. We should not be fighting each other. We should not be killing each other. We should be praying for each other. And I just ask that, you know, all these prayer warriors we got out here and people that are watching us, pray for this world. Don't pray, for, don't pray, just pray for this world. You can't call out everybody by name because there's so many people that need prayer. Just pray for this world. Pray for these kids. Pray for one another. And most importantly, pray for yourself. Amen? Amen. Yes.